Thank you so much for watching this review. Please watch it to its entirety to clear up any misconceptions and I'll show you exactly how to use this air purifier. Um, I find this air purifier to be of a great quality and I really like it. Um, your knobs are up on the top there. You have your, your fan speed here, your on off button and the UV light. I'll show you exactly where that is and um, how that works and it does work. Um, now here is the air purifier display. As soon as you hit the on button there, it will test your air and once it does that, it, which my air is good because I've been using it in here, um, but you, the rings will either turn red, yellow, blue, or white depending on air quality or odor. So it can sense all of that and that would be indicated in the display. Um, so here is your fan speed as well. You have one, two, three, I'm just hitting this button here. And then back to automatic. You can see here even at three, it's not really excessively loud. I love it for in an area of a kitchen to get out the smoke if you um, your regular fan above your, your stove is not sufficient enough or you know if you cook bacon fish you want to eliminate the odors <coughs> what i also like about this is the small size um, because it works great in bedrooms on nightstands or um, dressers or um, counter areas as well or living rooms or anywhere you can and it's very lightweight too um so this is the air purifier here and this is let me just turn this down a tad here put it on one um here, this is more like a rubberized material. I kind of like that. This is more of your plastic where the vents go. Now, I want to show you. Now, if you look at here, you're not going to see the light. If you hold a test card up to the top, you're not going to get a good reading. Please note that because you cannot see the light from the top. Now, let me show you where the light is on this. Turning it over here, and I'm going to leave this on as I do this. Here is the back of the filtration. Um, it's easy to remove the lid area. Your light is actually right there. There's your two lights. Now watch, if I come up here and hit the light button here, if you turn that off, my light's off. The light is positioned inside here to where the air is being sucked into the filtration, which is actually the best design for the lights. Um, you wouldn't want it up on top where the air is just blowing out. You want it to be right at the center of your filtration. So, I wanted to explain that to you. It has a nice long, I'm gonna unplug this here for a second. Um, it has a nice long cable as well adapter for your AC plug and when you put your filter in always put the filter in with the happy sign up for you can it's easier to pull the tag up if but it does have a good ledge in there too that you can do that um and you put this on find the spot where it goes and then um i would say too with it there it goes um you have your rubberized pads up here as well. This is plastic, but you have your rubber here as well. So it sits very sturdy. But um, I just wanted to show you the light thing on there as well. So that you understand that the UV light is on the inside. Once you plug it in again, you know, this is all the features again. Um, and you, what I like about it too, you can run it without the UV light. If you don't want that, that's fine. You can turn it off. And there you go. That's the sound of here. I got my refrigerator here and probably no one this right now. But yeah, I, I really like this. I love the compact size of it. I think it's a great <coughs> five layer air filtration with the UV light in the right place at the bottom. Wanted to just show it to you and describe it to you and uh, let you know that I think it works really awesome.